Hey guys, it's Agatha here, and we are doing a new video on how to install the DNP RX1 driver to Windows computer. Now, this is for you guys that want to print out the actual 4x6 cards. So, um, this applies to let's say let's take a let's, we'll take a session of four pictures, um, and our four pictures will consist of our photo strip. But what I want to print out, let's say, for instance, after my event, let's say, you know, I print out this photo strip, they take the four pictures, and this copy will print out. So this is for people that want to print out each individual photo number one, photo number two, photo number three, and number four. This is perfect. So when you're doing memory books, I usually, I'll print out a couple of the bride and groom just to kind of, you know, put that little extra kick, a little extra touch into the, the memory book. Um, and a lot of people really appreciate the big four by six pictures. So this is for those of you that want to be able to do that um, and offer your, your guests and customers the four by six option. So the way to do it is we're going to go to the internet and we're going to download the driver first. Once we download the driver, then we're going to install it, and that's when we'll be able to print a uh, 4x6 directly from our tablet or you know PC. All right, so here in Google, we're just going to type in your driver, DMP Arx 1HS driver. And then on the DNP website, you'll see that it'll have it. So right here, we're just going to click Drivers and Tools, Agree, and then we're going to scroll down to find it. So this is it right here. This is the driver. We're going to click on that. It's going to download at the bottom. So depending on your internet speed, it will download according to uh, the speed that you have. Right now, I'm connected to a hotspot and it's still downloading pretty fast. This is something that you want to do one time um, before your event, so that way when you're at an event, you could just right click, print, and print to the DMP RX1, okay? So let's wait 10 more seconds. So it's complete. I'm going to open when done. Wait for it. So this is real time. Then this happens. You're going to click on yes. Waiting for it. OK, here we go. We're going to click next. Accept. Next, install. So this is what you're doing before you even connect the printer, okay? So make sure you're running this before you connect the printer to the computer. All right, updating. So this whole process should take about anywhere from two to three minutes, maybe four minutes, depending on your internet speed. Um, and again, this is to print out the four by six photos, uh, the individual ones. Um, what if you decide to print out a two by six with the DMP, make sure you change your um, four by six to two by six or two by six to four by six, depending on what you're printing. But this is for um, this is another uh, example of where I use this at is when I do um, events at schools and I'll sell the pictures. So after they print out their photo strips, I'll say, hey, do you want photo number one, two, three, and four to be enlarged five dollars a piece, or I could do all four for fifteen. Um, that's just another way to make some more more money, um, but it's definitely a good tool to have. Please attach your device. Okay. So once it's already up, uh, completely installed, you're going to go ahead and connect your printer once this is complete. So here, um, for it to fully take an effect, you are going to have to restart your computer. For right now, I'm just going to uncheck that and I'll restart it after. Um, and then what you can do now is you could actually print out your 4x6s. So um, let's say, for instance, I'm going to click on this. I'm going to hit print. And 
after I restart, I should have the DNP uh, RX1 option. But because I haven't restarted, it will not be here. So make sure you restart. You'll be able now to, uh, after you restart, you'll be able to now print from your DNP RX1 directly from your Windows versus your darkroom. Okay, and this is beneficial for those four by six um, copies. All right. So you guys officially learned how to do, how to download and install the DMPRX1 driver. I really appreciate your time. Um, make sure you guys like and subscribe our to our video. Uh, and yeah, thank you so much. We'll see you in the next video.